boosts are jammed. Could use a push. Hey, Ben, we've got a clunker back here. Got it. Let's meet near his ship. What's going on with it? Just a laggy jump drive. There you go. Good as my granny's creaky old knee. Thanks, Ben. I'm nearly out of nanobots. Say, how's your ship holding up? Just the usual wear and tear. Don't tell me you want to run another mobility check. Can't risk you breaking down in the middle of a fight, can I? All right, knock yourself out. First, show me two healthy strafes, left and right. So hear your smile? Isn't it nice to have someone who cares for a change? Now some rolls. One, two. Finally, I need one last strafe with a boost to the right. As slinky rocket dodges go, I'd give you a four out of nine. Yeah, you're in good enough shape for the junk pile you're floating. Try telling that to Callahan. I bet 10 creds that if we don't catch up, he'll threaten to remove this ship from our tally. Nah, he's a jerk, but not that bad. I'll take that bet. Let's not keep him waiting, then. Just eight more shifts. Have you finally picked a homeworld? Yep. Eden 12 it is. Ridiculous name, but just can't say no to those terraform lakes. I can't imagine what it'd be like to finally be out. It'll be plasma gin and sunsets, my friend. After the slog we've been through, it's the least we deserve. Well, if it isn't our two slackers, five seconds longer and I would have removed this shift from your tally. What's the situation? There's a Hydra infestation clogging up the entrance. And since you're the one that gets paid for handling these things... so kind as to let you earn your creds. I'm on it. Still jammed? Nice. Wingman, you go in first and secure a path to the core. The engineer will follow with some distance in case anything needs fixing. How much distance? Enough to make a U-turn, should he run into trouble. The rest will wait outside with me until I give the signal. All right, I'm going in.
monsters in here. Yeah, and since the Hydra had time to spread but hasn't devoured them yet, I'd say they killed each other less than 48 hours ago. Scrap. Might want to consider that U-turn. Some of the outlaws may still be alive. Forget Callahan. I can take care of myself.
oxygen. You got this. I got this. I got this. Been here for quite a while. Over. Just a regular checkup on what I might know. Where do they grab you? Your outfit looks like GMB work crew. You guessed it. These jerks here got no style. Bunch of amateurs. They'll be looking to get the best price for you. So, given your professional opinion, you know a lot about outlaws. Hell, I know a lot more than they'll ever get from me. You hear me? If it ain't gas mask, so where's your boss? Things have Watch out! You may call this a warning shot. Attackers are advised to disengage at once. Great! Stuck between a rock and a damn flaming meteor. It's a colonial fleet. We better stick together if we want to make it out of this alive. Get ready to jump. No dice. Drives are jammed. There's a jump suppressor down there. I hope you know how to handle a cannon. This isn't my first dance, you know. Right. The military clone thing. Shooting scrap is in your genes. Your 
jurisdiction here. This is our last warning. Scans are being initiated on all units. Harboring a military clone is a violation against the peace treaty. Hand him over. We will find him either way. It's you they're after? I told the gas mask not to broadcast my profile. Let's finish this and get the hell out. you, Mr. Roslin. I'd suggest you submit your Sentinel without struggle. Hold on tight, pal. We're about to enter Superlight. Oh, man. Ah. You okay, Ben? Damn, he passed out. They're tracking us. You need to disconnect your nav, now! You can't fly blind. Shiny marker? That's our way out. I've seen clones fight before, but damn! Not your first dance. You're a goddamn prima ballerina. What's your name, pal? It's Adam. And that's Ben in the back. He really needs a medic. The only medics out here work for GMB, and that's not where you want to be right now. Not with a fleet warrant on your head. Man, we were one foot out of the DMZ. Don't tell me you had one of those GMB pension plans. It's called a Lionel Grady Retirement Scheme. Well, it's still a plan. And plans are for fools, my friend. I'm Dax, by the way. Let's get your friend into stasis at my old hideout. That'll give you some time to figure out how to save his life. Guess it's the only choice I have. Hey buddy, we're here. Oh man, you look bad. Ben's not responding. We need to do something now. There's a med bay, but we need to get to the control room first. So this is your hideout. This place looks huge. An old military post, founded decommissioned after the war. I laid low here for a few years after the DMZ was established. Here we are. Yeah, worse than I thought. Problem with the main reactor. It'll only hold us on basic for a while. How about the med bay? The cryopod can run on backup power, but no chance of getting the medical facilities running. All we can do for now is put your friend in deep freeze until we can get the reactor back up. I want to get him in there as soon as possible. All right. Let's take it slowly. In order to fix the main reactor, we'll need parts. I can help you with that. Good. I'll give you a shopping list then. <laughs> you know, this place ain't so bad. We just used it to lay low for a while, really. But I guess you could say we had some good times here. So you weren't alone. Here's the cryo. Yeah, looks like it's working all right. Sweet dreams, buddy.
Well, that's done. Now let's get the reactor running. I feel like you're not telling me something about this place. What were you hiding from? What happened to your colleagues? Yeah, I knew you'd start asking questions if I brought you here. Look, I took a gamble on you. Why don't you take a gamble on me now? Trust a little. I'll stay on comms and fill you in on what you need to know. A lot of stuff needs fixing. But we're still good on resources to patch up our ships or refill our ammo should things go south. There's also some space in the storage unit, so feel free to dump your cargo whenever it's getting cramped in that Sentinel. Here's a list of what we need to fix the reactor. Scrap metal, a cooling unit, all pretty straightforward. The cooling unit could be a problem. Check out that nearby debris field. That's your best shot at finding one. By the way, I took the liberty of installing two devices into your ship. An EMP generator and an energized boost. Not sure how I feel about you mucking around inside my ship. Yeah, well, let me know how you feel once one of my goodies saves your life. went to hell. What's kayaking? You serious? Scrap, we've got a visitor. Leave him to me. Maybe a good time to pop that gift bag and try one of your new devices. In the meantime, I'll lock the front door, just in case. how you clones worked. But I heard they gave you guys fake memory fragments to keep you motivated while fighting. If kayaking isn't in there, someone clearly didn't do their job. My memories are fragmented, but not fake. They're a mix of random experiences taken from my clone father's life and every incarnation that came before me. All passed on from clone to clone, until they ended up with me. Holy! So you're some kind of body-hopping immortal soul? Well, not anymore. The cycle was broken. So this time, when I die, I'm done. You know what I would do if I were you? No, what? Not croak before I've been kayaking. <laughs> I really mean it. If I ever get the chance, I will. More outlaws. Make sure that the area is cleared before you head back. Don't want anyone to kiss and tell about this base. Roach was right. We've got new neighbors. Let's give them the tour. There's quite a lot of traffic around here. Yeah, something must have happened to our cloaking system. Any luck with those resources yet? Checked off everything on the list. Great. Now bring the parts so we can give that reactor a whirl.
Let's fix the scrapper. Ha! It worked! Never thought I'd miss this shabby place. Those Bloodstar idiots had me locked up for ages. What do they want from you? Well, what they want from everyone. Credits and information. Unfortunately for them, I don't share with outlaws. Anyway, this is where we're at right now. We've got lights, climate control, and access to scans of our vicinity. Can the scans help me navigate Superlight again? I can't fly blind forever. Good idea. We can't reconnect our navs, or the fleet would immediately locate our asses. But with these scans... Here, have a look. Cedo Outer Rim? Rhodia Orbit and Union Bridge? That's as far as we can scan? It's far enough for now, at least what we need to do next. I need you to fly to all three locations, and keep an eye out for little devices we like to call beanies. Beanies? That's short for beanbags. They're small DIY signal distractors, and used to keep this base off enemy radars. But obviously they don't anymore. Sounds like a job for Ben. You need an engineer on this, not me. Why don't we focus on getting him fixed first? No time. We're lit like a bonfire. If we don't figure out what's wrong with the distractors now, we won't live long enough to save Ben. Tend to the beanies and make us vanish. That'll give us time to figure out what to do with your friend. off half of its antennas. Hey, try running a hollow scan to simulate the crash. And what do you think I just did? Smart man. to reattach them. First part fits. For disappearing act, we need two more.
place like this. Originally, I was stationed in the Ethan system as part of our rear guard subunit. We did some scouting missions, but really not much else. How many were you? Around 12. Some died, some became outlaws. Two pals and I got out before the war got really ugly. This is where we ended up. Feels like the edge of the universe. It isn't, but if you squint, you can see it from here. Any son of the beanie out there? Don't know. I got this marker jumping around on my display, though. Could be it. Try to follow it and keep me posted. By the way, if you need better tech, there used to be a trader around that area. He calls her shop the Flying Duchess. It may be worth checking out. Customer or outlaw? Customer, I guess. But can't you be both? Not here at the Flying Duchess, you can't. I operate an honest business. I see. Say, you look like you could handle yourself very well in a situation. Are you up for some challenges? Hunting outlaws in a more creative way. I'll even throw in some reward for you. What do you say? Let me take a look. Plug it back in. No! Keep your distance! Too late. Had a 
did you know it was a trap? It's called scavenger baiting. Outlaws do that a lot. Besides, beanbags don't run on power cores. So, removing the debris should be enough. Done. All beanbags are back online. You can see that. Our base marker is now everywhere but here. You can come back to base now. I found something that can make life a lot easier for you. Welcome to Union Bridge Station. We have repair facilities and a storage container with ship parts and provisions. As long as you'll be paying, I am happy to share. and the Ethan mutiny. Second Lieutenant Dexter Dax Bashar is facing murder and desertion charges after the death of First Lieutenant Gabbard Voigt. It is believed he was assisted and is still accompanied by Lieutenant Henley Maddox, transferring full entry to pilot log. A mutiny, huh? Check this out. While going through some old junk, I found some protective plating for your ship. It might give you an edge in an upcoming fight. I put it in our storage. Fitz? Dax? Who was Gabbert Vo Voight? I wondered how long it'd take for you to look me up. They say it was a mutiny. That you killed your superior officer. I didn't kill him, but I didn't stop it from happening either. That war, the things we all did, it wasn't right. My friends and I, we had a plan to get out and make it all mean something, but Voight was hell-bent on stopping us. And there I was thinking plans were for fools. Never said I wasn't one myself. Look, I know how hard it can be to trust someone. Maybe you'll find it easier if we focus on fixing up your friend and see where it goes from there. It's really all I'm asking. All right, let's start by having you head over to the Union Bridge Station and buy something called a Prime Sense STA. That's an old but untrackable scanner module. With it, we can finally see the entire system without the fleet seeing us back. And then? We use a scanner to look for a medical station. We loot the place, beef up our med bay, and let the medical AI patch up your friend. What if there are no medical stations around? Cedo isn't that small. We're bound to come across something. I was hoping for something more solid. Well, all right. What's the name of that scanner? Uh, Prime Sense STA? Correct. Have some faith, and I promise it'll be worth your while. <laughs> 